flabbergasted in the corner here, I think it's fair to say. You know, it's the thing our, our friend was talking about all the liberal elites telling us what to do and coming up with all these things. Well, we're the home of that in California, unfortunately. And we actually, we, we appear, I've had a front row seat to all of these sorts of ideas over the past 40 years. We actually started a campaign called Been There, Done That to document all of these excesses. And you all should take a look because they're coming to your state in the coming years. Uh, but I will say um, one of the things that we've been doing at PRI and what this award really uh, is kind of the cherry on top of our efforts is we believe that despite the long odds, we have the right ideas. And you can make untraditional alliances and move the ball forward on free market and conservative public policy ideas, even in California. And so uh, our work here for, for this award this year, we focused on uh, housing policy and the California Environmental Quality Act, which holds up housing and clean energy goals, all the things that the left talks about, well, their laws hold up these projects. Uh, we showed with our project called the Sequel Gauntlet, we actually showed in uh, a picture is worth a thousand words, so I think this is a picture is worth a million words of the bureaucracy. They're holding up the priorities of Californians. So, uh, and our work uh, also for this, we um, uh, recognize the work of Arlene Suzumi, who is our education scholar and who showed that homeschooling and school choice, especially coming out of a pandemic, people do want new educational alternatives. So. This award tonight, this certainly inspires us to continue the fight and continue battling literally on the front line. So thank you very much. Thank you.